you put a per, per order that i am going to purchase only t shirt one t one t shirt means that means uh, suppose sanjay is the customer he put one po or purchase only so, uh, one t shirt rajendra t- has joined so like i think right. we can restart the yeah, yeah, yeah. so that right. he will uh, know the background yeah okay 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 hi rajendra hello hi hi can you Good see morning, my screen rajendra Good morning. Sir. Yeah. Are you? Yeah, all good. Okay, that is you. Welcome. Yeah, you can see my screen. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Okay. So I'm just uh, rewinding my last class. What we did, we did the single order picking. Single order picking means what? Uh, the warehouse worker only picking the item only single order suppose sanjay has given the order or rajendra has given one order <coughs> rajan given one order suppose i am giving the one order but what the warehouse uh, warehouse worker will do he will pick only the sanjay order not rajendra gyan even the item suppose item a 3001 is available in location 1 okay and rajendra also uh, given the order a 3001 gyandeep also given the order for a 3001 but in single order picking what happened the warehouse worker only picking one person order <coughs> sorry so in this case what happened it will be very uh, time uh, taken because suppose uh, warehouse worker will uh, will be taken or will be picked only sanjay order and sent to bay door again come back again uh, collect the rajendra order again come back uh, into gyan order so what happened this will be time taken so this is not the correct way to picking but uh, j- some cases some uh, means uh, different types of uh, manufacturing oem companies they are using single order picking <coughs> because sometimes what happened in single order picking there are thousands of or 2000s of orders are there so at the time we are using single order but normal e-commerce normal uh, means mobile phone t-shirts shoes like that we are co- combining all orders and we are picking so let's see <coughs> so last time what we gone through that a uh, location directive wave template what template how to create the location how to pick the item and how to put the item mobile device how to set up the mobile device so remember always one thing <coughs> in the what template to currently we are doing outbound logistics so that's why we are using sales order okay once you are configuring in what template is what order type is sales order then in location directive also you should use the sales order only suppose you created the what template sales order you will create uh, location directive raw material or something purchase order it will not link so all the work order should be same okay so <coughs> one second so so okay site creation done warehouse creation done warehouse management setup also parameter setup also done last time location type we created location format we created location profile we created location also created then some quantity we have adjusted wave template created what template created location directive created then single cell sort of picking created <coughs> okay so now what happened we are creating one group ping group cells I mean cells uh, group picking group picking one second here <coughs> so what is group picking let's see this is location 1 this is location 2 this is location 3 okay so suppose sanjay has put an order rajendra put an order yeah. we have three orders for item <coughs> A double triple zero one or A triple zero two. Same uh, Rajendra has A triple zero one. Gandhi also put A triple zero two and A triple zero one. 
एंड आइटम इज अवेलेबल हियर इन लोकेशन ए ट्रिपल जीरो वन इज अवेलेबल एंड लोकेशन ए ट्रिपल जीरो इन लोकेशन थ्री ए ट्रिपल जीरो टू इज अवेलेबल so what happen our warehouse worker suppose you can say that our warehouse worker may be um, x y z <coughs> what when when we got three orders multiple orders you can say that but we are uh, as of now i am giving three only so we have received three orders suppose here in this case suppose uh, we will instruct to our warehouse worker to go and pick one by one single order then it will be time taken it will be time taken it will be uh, resource also going waste and for this also time also gone so for this scenario we just instruct to our warehouse worker collect all this uh, uh, means what uh, uh, orders and go to the location and collect one by one suppose he xyz is the warehouse worker he will go to the location he just found it suppose a, he given the order 10 संजय गिवेन द A301 आइटम गिवेन 10 सर इन्नलते ट्रांसेक्शन दिन इन्नलते एंट्री इटिटंडायरुन्नो 9 लक्षतिन्दे बाकी उल्लो दिन जानि पे चेयर डेकियो आड इन्नलते इन्नलते तिंगलाच रावले आमलतेक सर स्टेटमेंट डिटेल्स सर किटु इन जो वाइस आमलतेक आवा ओके संजय यू ओके थैंक यू सो व्हाट हैपेन संजय हैज गिवेन A301 आइटम 10 क्वांटिटी एंड A302 आइटम 5 क्वांटिटी Rajendra has given A triple zero. A triple zero one is five quantity. Gandhi has given seven and five. So what happened when the X Y Z is the warehouse worker? He will go to this particular location. He found that I need to collect ten, then five, ten, fifteen, and twenty. He will directly collect twenty items because he just combined, grouped all these sales and collect this twenty quantity. And then Raj for Rajendra A triple zero two uh, Sanjay five and five five and seven twelve. Then he will send to the Bedo location as per this order. So now I'm we are going to create this one. Okay. <coughs> so this is very simple. Only we have to put the query, nothing else. So for warehouse management, just see very very carefully what we are going to do now. go to the setup first we should go to the wave template go to the wave template so i am using uh tipping main wave template okay so i am just edit this one <coughs> actually the general the standard process is this one the standard process is this one okay so what i am going to do automatic wave creation automatic wave creation means when sell order or purchase order release from warehouse the wave automatically created process wave at release warehouse when we are uh, means um, um, it, 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 it when the uh, uh, sell order will be released from warehouse it will be processed it will create the work so as of now i don't want to create the work because we have multiple orders automatic wave release is fine Assign to open base. I should select. Assign to open base means what? In this checkbox, what happened? I am telling you. So what I did, I just I here what happened? I am not going to create the work automatically. This is the checkbox where work is created automatically. I just disable this one. Here what happened? The shipment will be created. The shipment will be created, and I am going to assign the wave and process the wave manually. i will show you what how it is happening i will show you just re remember this one so the wave template has been um, created i am just okay then i am going to create the work template okay go to the work and work template uh, okay so this is the fine i am going to change the header okay so One second. Here is something issue is there. Okay, G main. Uh, I am creating a new one. Let it be. When you are creating or uh, giving some query, you just uh, take a 61 SO stage and 62 uh, pick and pack. You should copy there only because whatever I mean, there is some issue I gone through today. I am not getting this work at breaks enable. So let it be. I am going to 62 pick and I just copy. I am going to. Uh, G main group 
okay so i just put a zero i am putting in top go to the edit query okay second i am removing the 62 because i am using my warehouse is uh, g main warehouse uh g main warehouse okay and go to the sorting in the sorting because what i am going to sort sorting means i am going to sort sort the item for group picking you can remember for group picking what i need to sort i need to sort the item and i need to sort the location because when worker will go he he will found that he will need to sort the item a3001 then again a3001 then a3002 like that he should sort the item from ascending a location suppose this item is available in location 1 location 2 location 3 location 4 particular item so he will not go randomly he will go one by one so we should sort the location also so when the warehouse worker entered to the warehouse he will just go to the first location suppose first location item is uh, finished then go to the second location so it should sort the location so i am just sorting the item number uh where is the you just a uh, temporary uh, suppose i am going to remove this one and i will create again add this one this will come automatically in the field you should give item number okay and you should give location location in ascending if you want ascending ascending or else if you want descending descending whatever you want click it okay group uh, will be reset continue okay when it will be, when you put the sorting that work header breaks will be enabled you should select the work header breaks okay uh group by the field okay i am going to remove this one don't don't want this one i'll use in this mobile device so what happened work header breaks means what when worker will go to the warehouse by using the wave template and he will go to the what template and uh, to sorting the item number and location so warehouse warehouse worker will do the work as per the what template and the item number location will be sorted out okay he will uh, this this will be done so just save it and i am going to change the pack location is there i am going to change the bay door okay save it now wave template so i am going to repeat it again what happened actually i am going to group it out okay i am going to just group number of cells that are uh, so that our warehouse worker will go to the particular location and he don't on, don't require to visit again and again he just go to in one way and collect the item for multiple orders so for that for that what i did actually where is my yeah so what i did i just check uh, that automatic verification checkbox is set yes means when we release the item from cell shader or warehouse that wave automatically process assign open wave means now i am not going to create the work automatically suppose you we want to create the work automatically when cell shader uh, release from warehouse then you should check uh, ch this checkbox should be yes but i don't want this one i don't assign the open waves means i should collect the cell shader i should collect the multiple cell shader in one box after that i will release after that i will release to uh, work got my point here what happen where in cell shader there is a release warehouse option is there you click the release warehouse then the work will be created but here what happen in assign to open waves i should collect all the cell shader and put in my box then work will be created i should collect up, um, thousands of or hundreds of uh, uh, means uh, cell shader then i want to process the wave and automatic wave release that work line uh, <coughs> picking work will be created now going to the what template what template what i did i just create this one i just giving the edit query same as the warehouse one second warehouse i have given in sorting i have given item number because what happened there are, there are i am just given two item now but there are multiple items are there so i just sorted the sorted out the items as per the number as per the because item here only a3001 a3002 in standard version is there but in customization the, there are number of item numbers are there so that, that this has been sorted out 
this has been sorted out in ascending to a i mean starting to ending and location also sorted out means once the worker will enter to the warehouse he will just starting location to ending location not in uh, in between he will enter and collect the item so this is done okay now wave template done location work template done now i'm going to the location directive let's see in location directive there is not required but still i'm going to check g main pick location yeah going to the edit query g locate pick location profile is there is fine i'm going to uh, multiple okay bed door is directive code is there multiple sq is there edit query bed door is the g bed door location profile is there okay and main put the same thing is there there is no change because i am i am to collect after that i will send to our end location so now i am going to one next step let's see how it is happening first we'll create the work after that we'll go to configure the mobile device this is from this will be done from our end and mobile device will used by the worker so i am going to the module account receivable you can see now what happened i am going to create multiple cells order click new suppose one customer is sanjay let's see this is uh, sanjay us 001 he purchase suppose g main click it okay okay what sanjay will do he should purchase a triple zero one item 10 10 quantity which uh, unit price is 10 rupees each okay i'm just going to set up it and don't require to put it in uh, means uh, uh, what reserve the item out manually and again uh, what sanjay will do he want to purchase a triple zero two also a triple zero two item also five quantity five pieces each pieces is five rupees five dollar and also this is also automatic okay just save it when uh, earlier what happened when you release the warehouse the uh, the, uh, the wave release the uh, four four uh, means what uh, notification will come where wave release work created chip and created now what happened when i am release that to warehouse you can see only two thing has created one is only shipment has created now you can see wave has been created for shipment one shipment has been created not work created only shipment has created means now the uh, shipment means what uh, we should assign the load means still load has also not created only the truck is ready you can you can in lam lam uh, language only the shipment the uh, truck is ready so now i am going to create another uh, cell order for rajender suppose us triple 002 the main same warehouse always because the item is available in same warehouse okay i am closing this one so rajendra what he want he want only a double 301 item for 10 quantity unit price 10 okay so i am just i don't want if you want to reserve the item here you can or also put it reserve automatic i am going to support reserve the item inventory reservation put it reserve lot now i'm going to release to warehouse uh, that is uh, ignore so only shipment now also one shipment created for uh, rajender so rajender has done now for me uh, a a triple zero two a triple zero one i am going to create another sales order i am going to create another sales for different customer suppose i am will be the different customer kev whole sales okay so uh i need a 301 
10 quantities what i need actually uh, okay triple the one five quantities five quantities unit price 10 i put the resolution automatic then i need a triple zero two uh seven quantities uh suppose uh, price is 10 rupees let it be okay so i save it now see very very carefully what will be happened why i have given the query for item number location for ascending so now three shipment has been raised for three sales order now just i am going to duplicate so now as per the wave template we are not creating the work we only created the shipment means only only the shipment uh, has been created through wave only that's it so assign to open wave checkbox means what now you are going to learn going to the module warehouse management collapse all outbound waves is there select outbound wave shipment waves is there because the a wave has been created only shipment so that's why I click the shipment waves pending waves is there because assigned open waves open waves means pending waves click pending waves now you can see one wave is created when you click the wave id you can see the three cells should be visible displayed here the 389 says sanjay rajendra and gyandip three cells has been created so assigned open may means what we have to select the shipments process the wave then only the work will be created when you process the wave click the process button in the top then now you can see the meaning of the assigned open wave means we can assign the open waves click process work will be created so i am going to again one duplicate tape so the work has been created under build this one so you can see, suppose I am going to the duplicate wave, duplicate tab. Okay, so I am going to the warehouse management. Sorry, what happened? Go to the warehouse management. Pull up solve work, all work. You can see that one work what is the wo uh, work 73 you can see in the bottom 173 work build has been work id created when you click the 75 work template you can see the item number has been sorted out in ascending order all the three cells item number has been uh, sorted out in in one line then add triple zero two got it first is one then two Location first is location has been ascending on a first pick location, pick one, pick one, pick one, then the second pick three, then bear door. So this is the format. Anyone has any issue, just let me know. I will create another one, not an issue. But you should so just remove your uh, doubt or whatever it is. Sanjay Rajan, you got that idea how it is working? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Rajan there? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, got it. Now you should go through my video. You will get easily that because I've given the uh, the examples, everything. So now what happened? You got that idea why I have given the assign open waves checkbox and why I have given the item number and location in ascending order in query. Because of this only I have given this one. So now our work has been completed. But still, suppose I am going to write back. You can see still nothing is created only work is created no load id no container id nothing is created we only work created but generally when uh, in the single order picking when work has been created you can see you can compare uh, this one and these things the load id will be created but here still the load means load means still the item has not loaded to the particular container there is no container id so now i am going to open the mobile device so work we have created but now we are going to create how the worker will pick. Okay. So I'm just open one item. Okay. So I'm going to the mobile device. Warehouse worker. Setup. Mobile device, mobile device, menu items. 
so i am just using mine only i don't create to number of uh, picking order picking everything so what happened this is the standard which we create earlier so always mention always remember whatever the war template whatever the war template because i am using this war template this war class id should be in this war classes or else it will not link with the war template and mobile device because war template and mobile device is only for workers they will know what to do in practically because we are doing but they'll know so the, you can uh, you can see that sales is there is suppose you will not add this work class id in mobile device when you entering the item it will uh, it will throw the error that work class is not linked so now what happened so in the work template you can ask me one thing here the work order breaks is there. We are grouping the item. Why we, I have not checked this checkbox? I have removed the checkbox. Why I am telling you? Here there is a one thing is there group pick. Okay, I am selecting here. I don't need to uh, work template. I I only I need group pick here. Also option is there group pick. But when you are practicing, you should use this one also. Oh sorry, I just one second. There is a something is there. I should rem I should remove this one. Delete one. I will tell you why this uh, things I deleted. Let it be. So I just group pick. Okay. So display inventory status. Inventory status is number of inventory status is there. Whether available, blocking, um, cycle counting. There are number of inventory status is there. I just want to yes. User directed means user. Who is a user? He will direct. He will direct to the. Um, means uh, to collect the item system director if you want to create when you were practicing you should use the system director user director both you should use because system director means system will automatically directed he system will automatically instruct you go there and pick the item but user director you should put the work id you should put the item number everything you will do that okay if you don't uh, select these check boxes so if, when you are practicing you should use system director and user director and this one okay this one will let it be we'll see later on so i just save it now okay i should have uh, 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 use the group pick now i'm opening the mobile device so for mobile device you should use uh, action okay double hs work executive Wait for two minutes. So let's see what is my worker. Whereas, okay, sorry, whereas worker. I've created my worker, but this I have to I have to delete. This is something wrong. Gyan uh, is the warehouse worker reset password. One, two, three. One, two, three. It's a mobile device. Okay, Gyan. One, two, three. Login. What was work? Okay, so it is the last uses. So G cell should have picking. Okay, I am selecting G cell should have picking. So I should scan the work ID. So where is the work ID? Work ID is this one. Actually, what happened? Uh, this is you are using. This is the emulator, but warehouse management uh, mobile device is something different where you can scan the work ID. So I'm just putting the work ID. 75 putting the 75 click it OK. Uh, G pick is the LP 00001. Okay, now you can see. Suppose you are going to the what template A0001 has how many quantity 10, 10, 5, 25. So you, you select in the mobile device in group pick. You can see here it is directly showing quantity 25. So we have used the item group pick. So using this 25 automatically will be displayed. Click it OK. 
okay target license plate is fine okay inventory status is showing available like that now gpic 3 is the license plate is the same i which i have created uh, item is a0002 is five quantity a0002 is five quantity, only five quantity okay and click it okay when you click it okay it will show total 30 quantity in the g uh, in the bed or location click it okay <coughs> okay so now you can see when i refresh this one the work has gone that means the work has been completed go to the all work again so close you can see the 73 this one is closed now Suppose you will use the group uh, grouped in the item number or location in the in the word template. Here, what happened? A triple zero one will show only once, and total will be shown twenty five. That's why I have not used there. Okay. So now, what happened? Our work has been completed. So we should complete my process. So go to the warehouse management. Go to outbound wave. You know, sorry, shipment. All shipments. Okay, so it should use the display closed shipments. Uh, which one? One second. Ten quantities. Okay. Okay. This three shipment created last time when you created the cell setup. Okay. So I am going to confirm the shipment. Sixty seven, sixty eight, sixty nine. So sixty seven, sixty eight, sixty nine has been confirmed. Sipped now, sipped. Go inside one by one. Because we have uh, picked the item in group, but we will create the packing slip. We will create the invoice in different, uh, different shipment as per the customer. I'm creating more packing slip and invoice to only for create bits again. Uh, Oh. Sorry, 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 sorry. You can hear me now, guys. Yes, sir. Hello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can hear me yes, now. Sir, okay, you can see my screen, right? Yeah, something network issue and gone. Yes, sir. So, yeah. Okay, I have I have just uh, created the invoice for Rajendra for, uh, sorry, Sanjay first. Click it. Okay. You got that guy, uh, guys, because I am telling you uh, re, uh, what happened. I think he left. Yeah. 